Hello guys, welcome back to the channel. I really want to tell you something. I bought a new guitar. Don't tell my wife. I heard you. <laughs> yeah, so that's my wife. No. Okay, so well, jokes aside, maybe you haven't noticed, I'm actually a guitar hobbyist and a guitar collector. So in this cabinet, you'll see some of my guitars and you might have a also seen it in some of our videos when we do our cover songs original songs or our play pause repeat why do i need one more guitar aside from other things that i collect so one of my passions is guitar collecting and i've always wanted to have my very own custom made filipino made guitar Ooh. Yep. while scouring the internet for guitar luthiers in the Philippines. Somehow I haven't really like found the good ones. I don't know why. I've always found like the bad ones, which was very disappointing. However, a gentleman in Facebook invited me to their group and the name of the group was Filipino Acoustic Guitars Paradise Forum. Link in the description box below. I was really very happy to be invited into that group because I found and read an article about a small bench luthier in the Philippines and his name was William Alama and his company Alama Strings. Yeah. Also a link down below. So in this article I found out that William Alama and his brother Jason Alama were chosen to be the official guitar luthiers for the project. And that project is named Guitara Ni Juan. And this is a big deal actually, because amongst all the luthiers in the Philippines, they were chosen to create 12 classical guitar prototypes. The researchers for the project wanted entry-level classical guitars because of William Alamo's craftsmanship and passion for making guitars. The researchers said that they've actually exceeded the standard that they were hoping for. So after I read the article, not only was I confident enough, I was also impressed with William Alama's craftsmanship when I went through his Facebook Alama Strings page and I saw like some pictures and in YouTube so there were like uh, sound tests or videos of his guitars and I was really impressed with it. the sound quality of his guitars given the woods that he's using. Yeah, I liked his guitar because there were a few guitars where he used like coconut shells for the fretboard, coconut shells for the uh, bindings which is not common to see in some guitars. For the price point, not really that expensive, but if you're living in the Philippines, it might be. Because his guitars start at around 13,500. I don't know if he has cheaper guitars, but yeah. As far as I know, the cheapest guitars he is making is 13,500. And if you're going to have custom built guitars, so it's going to increase in price. But I assure you that 30500 for that price of a guitar is going to blow your mind away. How do I know? Well, just look at the videos, look at how he sets up the guitar. Actually the 30500 in my opinion is actually already cheap for the quality he's making the guitars. I ordered my guitar around August and while watching this video so it would be around already December so yeah. Since he's a small bench guitar luthier, so yeah, it'll take time. But that's what I'm hoping for, that he takes his time making my guitar. Because I want his sweat, his blood, his passion per se in my guitar that when I hold it, I know and I feel the craftsmanship in the guitar. The good thing about William is that I requested him to take video snapshots of how he's making my guitar so you'll actually see some videos of it in a few moments. Please be patient if you're curious about the specs of my guitar, what size is it, so unfortunately you'll have to watch the next few episodes or parts of this video. So guys if you're really interested to having your very own Filipino made guitar I do suggest clicking down 
on the links below. You could join the Facebook page. You could also message him personally. Just go through the Alama Strings guitar page. But as promised, so you're going to see a few snippets on how he's made my guitar. Or maybe a few pictures. Yeah, so guys, if you like this video, click that like button, click that subscribe button, and click the bell button. Supportahan natin ang gawang Pinoy.